I'll be showing you step by step how to remove the cart icon in the Shopify Spotlight theme. We're going to do so with some custom bit of CSS. It's just going to take four lines of code, but don't worry if you've never written any code before as I'll be walking you through everything. I'll be showing you how to create a backup as well. So if you make any errors along the way, it's easy to restore to that. So let's start things off from our Shopify dashboard here and click on online store in the left hand side menu. And this is going to be under sales channels. As we can see, Spotlight is currently installed as my current theme for my store. And if I click view your online store to open up a preview, I can see the cart icon in the top right here. And if I click on the cart icon, it's going to load the cart page. So let's go and remove this step by step. So let's head back to the Shopify theme section. And before I go and add any code, I want to click on these three dots here and go to duplicate. This is going to create an exact copy of my currently published theme. And it's so much easier to restore from a current backup than it is to go and figure out exactly what you did wrong. This can happen if you accidentally remove certain styling or code or certain sheets in general or files in general. And this can be a huge headache to go and restore them. So I always recommend creating a backup. So next, let's go and edit the code. I'll click the three dots here, go down to edit code. And this is going to open up the code editor for my Shopify Spotlight theme. To note, this is going to be the same coded editor used for any Shopify theme, but the files are going to be different. If we click into any of these files, it's pretty intimidating. There is a ton of code, but we'll be ignoring the vast majority of it. So in the top left, under filter files, which is basically a search bar, I'll search for CSS. Under assets, which is a folder here, there should be a file called base.css. And if I scroll all the way down to the bottom here, we're going to ignore all the code above it. We don't need to touch any of it. I'll hit enter a few times to create a few new lines. I'll zoom in a bunch so you can see exactly what I'm writing. And we just want to write four lines here. It'll be period, header, underscore, underscore, icon, dash, dash, cart, left curly bracket, which would autocomplete that right curly bracket. On the next line, I'll write display, colon, none, semicolon, enter for a new line, visibility, colon, mistype that there. Then we're going to have hidden, semicolon. So these are the four lines of code and you probably noticed it as well, but I had a typo in visibility. So let's add that extra I there and remove the extra text added after the autocomplete. So it's period header underscore underscore icon dash dash cart left curly bracket new line display colon none semicolon new line again visibility colon hidden semicolon with a closing curly bracket. So let's zoom back out. I'll hit save in the top right here. And then let's click the preview store button in the top right to see if everything is working okay. And if we look at our navigation here, we can see there is no more cart icon, which is exactly what we were trying to do. And we did exactly what we set out to do here. If you've made any sales on Shopify, you know how hard it is to keep track of how much money your store has actually made. That's where our sponsor Profit Calc comes in the one-click profit calculator available for your Shopify store. All you have to do is select the date range you're looking for to get real-time calculations so you can see how profitable your Shopify store really is. It's going to give you tons of details, analytics, and breakdowns so you can truly understand your store's performance so you can start making smarter business decisions. It's going to save you hours and hours of time so you don't have to go and use spreadsheets that you're going to update once a month. Profit Calc is going to enable you to stay on top of your store and you can get started with a 15-day free trial so you can test drive everything for yourself. You can find it in the Shopify app store by searching profit calc and looking for this logo in the top left. There's also a link in the description below to access that Shopify app listing directly. So make sure you check that out and start truly understanding your store's performance. So this is going to conclude the video on how to remove the cart icon from your Shopify spotlight theme. If this video helped at all, I would love it so much if you smash that like and subscribe button below. If you have any questions, leave a comment, but thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.